Welcome to Daddy Jack's Cover the Blues. So, Bob, you learn something every day, you know? And uh, Bob, Bob, just put that over there. Honey. Bob was telling me, you know, uh, uh, so I told him I had some fresh blue flounder. Look at this stuff, it's so beautiful. We just filleted it. You can check our video out how to fillet a fluke. But uh, you know, Bob said, how about uh, how about some almondine? I hadn't done almondine in so many years, but I was a chef at a Belvedere, a Swiss Austrian restaurant. Heinz showed me, put a little bit of Worcestershire on top. It's really made out of anchovies, you know, uh, fermented anchovies. So what I like to do, I like to fold that tail over, okay? So it cooks kind of evenly. Okay, I want to be careful. I just put a little, just a little bit of salt and pepper. We don't want much on there. Okay. And the seasoned flour. Make sure it's all uh, coated well. A little bit of olive oil. A little bit of whole butter. Okay. Shake off the excess. The side that you're going to serve up, put down first. Okay. Let that brown up real nice, okay? So everybody does a sliver on this way. So you know what? We're gonna do something a little different. We're gonna do some smashed almonds. See? We're gonna try a little different texture, see? I'll just salted and roasted almonds. Something different. Right, Bob? We got a nice color that that Worcestershire gives it. See? funny story so so Bob so this is how I did it probably 1985 I did this uh, the sole just like this I really loved it so I had two or three restaurants after that I did the sole the same way so I get a job at City Cafe it was already an established well you know rated in the top 10 restaurants in Dallas so I go in there and we have a sole uh, sole almondine on the menu I do it just like this and one of the one of, the, one of the waiters goes running to the owner and said, ah, oh, this new chef, he's changing up our whole, our whole system. So, owner comes back, the first day of the job. I said, you know what? That waiter just made his life a whole lot harder. I, you know, cause, cause this flavor here is so much better than just the plain plain season, but here, this is what I'm going to do, put it right under the, right under the, you know what, I'll finish you right on, I'm going to finish you right in the skillet, it's such a delicate fish, give me a round plate, here we go, I was gonna do it on the brush, so I'm just gonna finish it out just a little bit more on this side. That's a little bit more. See that beautiful color? Oh, you don't need that. Not for you. 
Hey, Bob. Hey, now we're going to make our sauce. Turn this, turn the fire off, put this under the warmer. So. Butter. Maybe not so much butter. Take a little bit out. Put a few of the almonds in there. Lemon juice. And just a touch of Worcestershire. Okay. that sauce up a little bit. Guess what else, Bob? Oh, I think I know. All right. Tighten that sauce right up. Huh? Okay. Watch yourself here, Bob. And then good. All right, Bob, you know the drill. Give me the camera. Give me the camera. It's your idea. You got to do the sampling. All right, Bob. Okay. Like that. You're hot. Awesome. Huh? Awesome. Too hot? Perfectly cooked. Can't get any better than that, Bob. Right, two, yeah. day, two days out of the water. Mm. All right, Bob, my turn. Want to try it, Javi? Huh. Taste that what you share, Bob? The oh, nice, yeah. nice little flavor. smoky. Daddy Jack's going with the blues. Oh man, that one broke out a sweat on me, Bob. Woo. So that's a uh, fluke, fluke or flounder francais, or fluke amandine, I'm sorry. Fluke or flounder amandine. It's Daddy Jack's going with the blues here. Thank you, Mystic Way, Robin and Mystic Way brought us a beautiful fish. Bob, we had 2,500,000 hits. Who would have thought, right? It's crazy. We're like grassroots, we're starting to snowball. It's all because of the beautiful, the beautiful world out there, the wonderful world of the internet, and our fans, people that appreciate, we got a call. I gotta, I gotta get uh, Jim's, Jim's brother's name. That's the, uh, the uh, Jupiter Waterfront Inn. Jim and his brother run it down there. And he, he called yesterday, thanked us for a video, said, you come on down and be our guest anytime. We're going to go down and visit, do a couple videos from down there. Love you all. Peace.